Yes, guys, I know a good number of DV selectees for DV 2024. You have completed your DV Rotary interviews at your respective embassies. So I know for you who have completed the interviews, you are aware that you, we are no longer submitting the supporting documents to KCC. So for those who have not completed your interviews, I know you finished to submit your DS-260. But since October, or since the interviews for DV 2024 started, they issued the notes on the website that we are not supposed to submit your supporting documents to KCC and onwards. So I think the system changed. There was change in the system that the documents which we have been submitting to KCC after submitting your DS-260. So you are supposed to organize your documents. You just wait for the second notification letter. Then you have to go with all your documents when you are going for interview. Let me hope I'm clear. I know that for those who have completed their interviews, you are aware of this. And I know at this time, no one who is still submitting the DS-260. For sure. If we were there, then you have some mental problem with you. For sure. If at this time you have not submitted your DS-260, uh, uh, my God, just blame yourself. Don't blame anyone. If you will not get the second notification, Rata from KCC. Because at this time, for everyone who applied, the way people they used to be eager waiting for results. So, and you spend all this month, almost seven to eight months when you have not submitted your DS-260. My friend, there is a problem somewhere, somehow. It's for you just warm for the DV-2026 to apply. But let me go back to my issue. Since we no longer submitting these documents, the supporting documents to KCC, it is somehow good for someone who is not prepared, who is who doesn't have the organized papers with him, for someone who needs to move distances to look for his papers, and even in the way some countries they process some of these documents. So it is an advantage that there is room for someone to prepare all the required documents so that you go when you already have all the documents. But there is a disadvantage here that at least for KCC, when you submit a document and they find out that the document doesn't meet their standards, at least they can email again to submit another document which meets their requirements. But at this time, you have to organize all your documents. Remember the documents we used to submit to KCC, there was police clearance, there is marriage certificate, there was birth certificates, and other documents. So, but all of these documents, you have to organize all of them so that you can go with them at the interview day. So just imagine that you go with documents which does not meet the required standard for USA. You see, you will reach there, they will send you back to bring the documents. So that is double spending. So it is somehow advantage to one side and a disadvantage to one side. So what you should do is that make sure you get the documents which is required and get the documents from the required authorities in your respective country. Don't go to forgery cafes to make for you forgery, forgery certificates, forgery marriage certificate, forgery birth certificate. All other documents, some even they go to the extent of making forged academic documents. 
So don't do that. Because when you go to the website of USA Immigration, there is where you can check where you can get the document from your respective country. Which authorities can give you the document in your country. So that one is there at the website. You can go and check if I want marriage certificate, which authority should I go in my country? They indicated it is there. If I want academic document to satisfy all my academic documents, where should I go? It is there. They indicated there where you are supposed to get that document. The marriage certificate, they indicated where you are supposed to get it. All the documents, they indicated. So, that means if you submit to them a document which you have not get from one of those mentioned authorities from their website, they will consider that document to be fake and you will be required to go back and get another document from that authority. So if you see in Uganda, because I know what is in Uganda, the police clearance, you know where to get from Naguru. Then the birth certificate, you are supposed to go to Nira. So even if you get your birth certificate from anywhere, which is not in Nira, they will not accept. Because for them, they have access to check if that document is right. If that document, you get it from Nira. Hmm? So for your name, this HSC certificate, high school certificate, in from UNEB, they indicated there. The marriage certificate, they also indicated. Uganda Bureau of Standards, it is there. It is well indicated there at the website. So don't go with forged papers because you will spend double. You will go, for example, you will go to Nairobi and you will be required to go back to Uganda and get the right documents. And then you go back. That is double spending. So, plan your journey because they give you the second notification letter in time. So, just get prepared. Okay? Then, on KCC, so we are just on a submitting the DS-260 form only. The immigration form, the visa form. That is the only document which is submitted to KCC. So, after submitting it, they will make a review. They will confirm the information you provided to them. Then they will schedule for you the interview. Then that is when you will receive the second notification letter. So when you receive your no second notification letter, that means you have to make the bookings of the medical examination. Then interview. Then you will go for your interview and do it so those are the changes which they made since october up onwards so that means even dv 2025 we shall not be submitting the document to cases unless when there is a change which they made from the website so enjoy this video don't forget to subscribe don't forget to cop to comment like and share to your friends i wish you those who are waiting for dv 2025 results they are coming soon